Hi guys, we're going to Simply Scuba. Here we have the Orca Torch D630. So this is an umbilical torch. It's very, very powerful. It's got one sneaky hidden little feature. Well, it's not really that hidden, uh, but it's really useful for, uh, for scuba divers. Uh, let's take a closer look. So first of all, this is the box that it comes in, um, and this has all of the information on it. So I'm just going to rattle off a few of the um, a few of the figures on this. Um, so this is 4,000 lumens maximum output, which is very, very bright. Um, it's got three different power settings. You've got high, middle, and low. So 1,500 lumens is that kind of middle setting, which is still quite bright, um, especially for blue waters, but for murky waters, that's kind of about right. So I probably go a little bit higher, but hey. Uh, and then we have a low power setting of 460 lumens, which is just the kind of the battery saver. Um, but if you're um, sort of night diving in the Red Sea, that would be sort of more than enough for me. Okay, um, runtime anywhere between five hours at sort of maximum output to 23 hours and 50 minutes. So just shy of a day at, uh, at low power, which is very, very impressive. Um, yeah, so that means you just don't have to recharge that battery quite so often. Um, so this is quite a tight uh, sort of spotlight beam, seven degrees. I'll show it all um, sort of switch on in a second. Um, 150 uh, meter depth rating, which is impressive. Um, overall, it weighs 1.37 kilograms, but in the water, it's only about um, sort of 0.6. So it's a little bit negatively buoyant. Uh, so it will sink a little bit, um, but yeah. So otherwise, yeah, let's just get straight into it. So the box comes in, pretty standard cardboard box. Inside, um, everything's kind of stowed away except for that, that just fell out. Um, so um, you don't get a separate case for it, which is fine. You only really want the torch though, don't you? Um, let's take a look at what you get with it. So obviously you get the torch itself. We have this little bag of accessories, which has an Allen key and two little bolts uh, and a couple um, sort of friction washers. Um, so that'll be for the Goodman style handle, I imagine. We have the battery canister itself and then that will attach to a cable there's a lot of stuff crammed into here and then the actual torch which is attached ugh, already to the Goodman style handle um, but I'll show you that in a second I promise um, so I skipped over the uh, the UK charger so just a standard uh, sort of three pin charger that goes into ugh, the little uh, sort of power pack, so that's going to recharge it. Um, we have a lanyard, just a standard uh, sort of wrist lanyard. Um, we've got a spare silicone loop for the uh, for the head of the torch. If you want a spare, or if you've got really skinny wrists, you might wear that as a bracelet. It's really skinny wrists though. Um, spare O-rings, three of them, and they're already pre-greased, um, so just kind of keep them in your kit bag. I imagine they're spare O-rings. You don't have to fit these. Um, it's just when the actual o-ring start to wear out book of words in there as well just the user manual how to um, sort of get through stuff and uh, sort of how it all works and that's it for the box so onto the torch so as it comes uh, it's not really that practical as you can see because the handle is upside down um, so if you undo this little screw you should be able to eventually loosen it off and then you can have your Goodman style handle kind of as big or as small as you like. Um, so you just kind of clamp that down wherever you want it. And if you're wearing clunky gloves as well, if you're wearing dry gloves, you can also undo these uh, little bolts and then extend that as well. So very, very practical. Four LEDs in the front, so that's what's kicking out that 4,000 lumens. The battery on the top, uh, sorry, the, uh, the button on the top has like a locking mechanism. So when it's like this, you can't press that button, but if you rotate it and then press it, then you can switch it on. So pressing it just cycles through the different modes. So this is it at full power. I uh, just shine it at myself and blind myself so you can kind of see the, um, the, the beam. So it's a fairly tight beam, which is practical. This is good for uh, sort of communicating with your buddies and sort of focusing on one thing in particular without blinding everyone. Uh, if I dial it down and then down again, that's kind of the lowest setting, which is still pretty powerful. And then again, and it switches off. So then we have a umbilical cable, pretty long umbilical cable. Um, so you've got plenty of room to uh, sort of attach this canister to your back. And you have a couple ways of doing it. So normally with um, sort of canister batteries, you, you either have the cable coming in at 90 degrees like this, or it comes in 180 degrees like that. So for side mount di uh, divers, you want to uh, sort of swap that round. But instead of having a fixed option, 
Orca Torch have just made this very simple little um, sort of screw collar, which lets you kind of swap between the two. So depending on how you need that sort of cable to be routed, you can make it as neat as you like. So it comes as standard with a Velcro style um, kind of loop that can go over like two inch webbing. Um, you can probably pretty quickly and easily sort of replace that with whatever you want. Um, and then there's just standard uh, sort of tightening grip Alice bands as I call them. And, uh, and yeah, a fairly neat but fairly lightweight um, sort of canister. I imagine you unscrew it to get to the batteries. <clears throat> And then inside we have, these are the battery com uh, sort of compartments. So that's gonna be how you recharge it. So plug that in and, uh, and that will recharge it. You also have a USB power point. So you can actually use this to recharge your phone or your smart device uh, with a USB charger. And you also have that battery level indicator. Just push on that little uh, button and uh, those little LEDs tell you how much juice is left in the tank. So all in all, it kind of ticks all of the boxes. It's nice and powerful. You've got a decent sized battery that's multifunctional. You can use that on the uh, on the boat as well. If you get back to your kit bag after a dive and your phone is dead, but you still have the charger, you can recharge it with that. Um, it's an umbilical torch, but you've got that sort of functionality of it can be 180 degrees or 90 degrees. So that's very practical. And, uh, and yeah, Goodman style handle is pretty much everything you need. So yeah, it's ticking all the boxes for me. I definitely like it. This is the Orca Torch D630. Thanks for watching and safe diving. We are an online dive store serving the UK and the world for all your diving equipment needs. So why not visit us at simplyscuba.com or click the box on your screen.